Hello everyone, welcome to Digital Artifacts YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to create this simple website background in Adobe After Effects for your Wix website. So we're going to be using Adobe After Effects to create this as well as the plugin Trap Code Particular. So to create the falling particles, you will need the plugin Trap Code Particular. And here you can see what it looks like as a website background. So you can see the falling particles in the background. So now we're ready to jump right into the tutorial. So I'm going to open up Adobe After Effects and we're going to start by creating a new composition. And we'll just leave these settings as a standard HD 1920 by 1080. And I'm just going to rename this website background. And I'm going to keep the dur duration at 20 seconds. And then just click OK. So the first thing we're going to do is create our background layer. So we're going to go to layer, new, solid. And I'm just going to rename this BG. And we're going to have the same settings. The next thing we're going to do is add an effect to the background. So we're going to go to effect, generate, gradient ramp. And now here, I'm going to change the colors um, to a purple and black, but you can change it to whatever color you want. Uh, so for this first one, I'm just going to click here to change the color. And then for the bottom portion of the composition, I'm going to change it to a dark blue color. So now we have our background ready. So now what we're going to do is add the particle layer. So we're going to go to layer new solid and rename this particles, same settings, click OK. And then we're going to go to effect trap code particular. And then we're going to go into the designer tab. And I think you need the um, trap code suite 14.1 or later to have the designer tab presets. So what we're going to do is go under single system preset and we're going to go under the dust and debris and we are going to select the moon dust and then we're going to hit apply. And that's it. Just with a few simple steps, you can create this really cool sparkly website background. And the only thing left to do is just render the footage. So we're going to go up here to the project panel and make sure your render queue is selected. And then we're just going to drag our composition into the render queue. And then just select output module and we're going to select QuickTime. And then when the box opens up, you just under format, you're going to select QuickTime. And after you select that, just click OK. And then you can also change your output to where you want to save your file on your computer. And then on the right hand side here, you just click render and your footage is going to render. And that's it for this tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe.